Hey Warrior family, it has been a while since I've been live and wanted to come to you today to say first hi and miss you um, and explain a little bit why. I just, I've had some things crop up in other businesses and it's been um, a complete joy and a ride and I haven't been able to put as much attention over here, but things are slowing down this week, so I'm back. Um, and I wanted to share something with you today that I heard from a fellow warrior yesterday, which is this idea about moderation. So comment if you often struggle with this idea of moderation, right? Like we, we say like eat in moderation, drink in moderation, but what the fuck is moderation? You know, and that's really the crux of the reason people have trouble with moderation is that they haven't defined what that means to them. So you have to start thinking about what does moderation mean to you? And then over the course of time, you'll make two millimeter shifts up in terms of like the strictness of your moderation. So let me give you an example. And the reason this is a problem is because people say, moderation, I can't reach moderation, so what's the fucking point in trying anyway, right? Well, there is a point to trying to achieve this moderation, and um, I'll give you an example. So right now, currently, my moderation is that in food is that I eat 80% raw, so fruits, vegetables, nuts, seeds, raw, okay? I eat 20% concentrated food, which is things like grains, um, quinoa, protein, um, because I do eat small fishes, and, it, you know, anything of that nature, okay? So 80% raw, 20% concentrated. And then I have five days a month, five days out of a month, I guess five, more like five meals out of a month, where I zag, meaning like I don't eat like that. So it might be like an ice cream, like a dairy-free ice cream because I don't eat dairy, but like an ice cream, something sugary. Or um, one of my other zag days might be going and having like a, like a veggie burger with like sweet potato fries and just like go all in on whatever that is. Okay, so five zag days a month. That's how I currently eat. That's my current moderation okay, that I can live by. But it wasn't always like this. There were times, if you dialed me back, like three years ago, my moderation looked completely different, right? It looked like, let me eat a clean breakfast and a clean lunch, and then for dinner I can do what I want. All right, so you have to first decide, and if this is with drinking, you have to decide like, what is moderation for me right now? If you're drinking a six pack a night, Moderation for you is not going to be just drinking on Friday and Saturday. Like, that's not achievable. It's not attainable. So you want to dial it to something that is a little bit outside your comfort zone, but not way off in the stratosphere, because you're not going to be able to do that. Well, you might if you had enough leverage, if you had enough Y power. But if you're not working with a coach, if you're not working with, you know, within a program, if, you're not, if you don't have accountability to do that, it's going to be really, really, really challenging unless you have a really, really, really strong Y power, which only happens from a lot, a lot, a lot of pain. So if you're in this place of like struggling with like doing it, just try not to like go way off in the stratosphere, just make a small change, right? So if you're drinking a six pack a day right now, maybe moderation looks like drinking four a day. That's moderation for you right now. And then a month or two, maybe you cut back to two a day, right? Or maybe then you cut back to like four days a week, five days a week, okay? So and when I want to share this with you because it is attainable, but the first thing you have to do is decide what is moderation for you. And fuck the judgment of what anyone else might think is moderation and what's their definition of mod moderation. That's their perception. Who cares? Who cares? People think I'm crazy that my moderation is what it is. They're like, that's not moderation. That's insane. 80% raw? Have you lost your fucking mind? How many fucks do I give? Give zero fucks. So... Figure out what moderation is for you, make it attainable, make it a two millimeter shift and then go for it. And when something happens and like, let's say I have six or seven zag days in a month, I don't beat myself with a fucking baseball bat because I didn't achieve my perfect moderation. You know, it's like, oh, I'm striving to be my best. That's where I was at this month. All right, I'm going to move on. Because if we just beat ourselves with a baseball bat, that's when you get to the point where there's no point in this anyway, right? Make it achievable, make it attainable. Send yourself a lot of love and um, just really decide what is moderation for you. And I'd love to know what that is. So send me a message if you've made some new decisions after watching this video, which decide, you guys, means to cut off. It means there is no other choice now. All right? 
Talk to you soon. Have a great weekend. Bye.